Yo, yo, what is going on, all my wonderful dragons out there? Ted Dragon here, bringing you all back to uh, another video. And I just want to talk about Black Ops 4 for a minute. Will this Call of Duty bring us back to the old Call of Duty days? No. That is, that's the answer to that big ass question everybody, including myself, has always asked. Will this next Call of Duty bring us back to the good days? No. No. It'll never be like that. Especially now with Fortnite. Like, Call of Duty isn't going to go back to the Black Ops 2 and Modern Warfare 2 days. Notice how the 2s were always the best. Ooh. So, wait. Does that mean if they make another Call of Duty, like, not a sequel, like... Say they made Advanced Warfare 2 instead of um, World War 2. World War 2 wasn't that good. But anyway, it's alright. But if they would have made an Advanced Warfare 2, maybe like if it was boots on the ground, maybe that would have fixed it, you know? But anyway, Call of Duty will never be back to the old days. Like... We all need to get used to that, including myself. Trust me, you all have no idea how much I want Black Ops 2 back. Like, a good fucking Call of Duty game. Black Ops 2 was my favorite, as I said in my last video. But, for Black Ops 4, either way, I'm just letting y'all know. I'm going to be doing some eSport biatches. One way or another, I will. I won't stop until I'm doing some MLG, some eSports, some good game battles. I've done game battles before. Not good, though, sadly. But anyway, I won't stop. I'm using the plan I've used for the past. Like, just got to make it all better, you know? I've just got things I'm working on that'll help me achieve me being like me do good in Call of Duty esports. Wow that sounded so professional me do good. I've got a plan. Let's just go with that. Alright. Now second question is this game going to have boots on the ground? Obviously not. But what I thought about it from the live stream from the event they broadcast it looked like infinite warfare it kind of did it kind of pisses me off that they have specialists and it's still kind of futuristic and i don't really like that but you know i haven't played the game yet so i can't really you know can't really judge it until i actually play it which I will be getting me the pre-order, so hopefully I'll be able to do the beta, and if I can't, well shit, but if I can, then hopefully it doesn't remind me of Infinite Warfare or World War 2. I'm fine if it somewhat reminds me of Advanced Warfare, because again, I like that game. That game was fun, for me. For other people, not so much. Speaking of which, I might play that after I record and edit this video. But anyway, Call of Duty Black Ops 4. Who saw this coming? Everybody. Shit. Even before they made... No, they made Black Ops 3. Yeah, whenever they made Black Ops 3, someone fucking photoshopped the Black Ops 4 symbol. Like using the black ops 3 so people saw black ops 5 coming they made black ops 5 damn it wait no it was black ops 4 yeah they made the 4 but it this 4 is different they saw black ops 4 coming and that means they might stop at black ops 6 and by then call of duty will most likely definitely be dead in my opinion, I think Call of Duty has run its course. And 
sadly, even though I enjoyed the game. It's all thanks to Sledgehammer and Infinity Ward for fucking it up. Thank you, you assholes. I don't see who the fuck agreed to do jetpacks. Like, even people are asking if they should remove the jetpack from fucking Fortnite. I enjoyed the jetpack in Fortnite. Shit. That shit's OP. That's what I like about it. They need to keep it. Not execute. Anyway, what they need to just do is give up. Well, wait, wait, wait. Rewind. Don't give up. Do not give up on Call of Duty. All right? Not until y'all stop making billions of dollars like y'all still do. Shit. Wait. Call of Duty is the most played game ever. Probably GTA, actually. Maybe. It's probably Call of Duty, then GTA. It used to be Halo. Yeah, used to be Halo, then Call of Duty came along and stole the spotlight for a really, really long time. Modern Warfare 3, Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, Ghost. Wait, it was Infinity Ward who fucked it up with Ghost. Yeah, they made ghosts and everything went downhill. It all just went splat. Dead. Like, everyone started hating Call of Duty. But, I fuck with ghosts. Not all the way, but I fuck with it. Like, it's fun. See, I fuck with these Call of Duty games, but they're not Black Ops 2. Black Ops 2 has been my favorite that's the only game i could probably if i could always get into an actual lobby on ps3 i would be playing black ops 3 daily y'all would still be seeing those videos black ops 2 not black ops 3 i just realized that but anyway black ops 4 all we can do is hope they'll bring us the good days even though we know it won't the good days they're long gone they've passed you know it's like having that one special kiss then going to kiss the same person thinking it'll be special like it again like y'all first kiss then going back to kiss them and it'll be completely different, you know? But anyway, again, all we can do is hope that Black Ops 4 will make it all better. And if it doesn't, son of a fucking bitch. Why'd they have to screw us, you know? Like, why? Why Infinity Ward? I blame y'all. Then I blame, actually, I blame whoever's dumbass idea it was for Jetpack. Because that's how Fortnite got created, you jackasses. Anyway, hopefully y'all enjoyed this video. As I said, Black Ops 4 will not bring us back to the old days. But all we can do is hope. And again, watch those esports circuits, the pros. I'm coming for y'all. Especially you scumper. Bang. Anyway guys, I hope you all have a flaming day. Peace out.